Uh, today we're going to do a beautiful uh, intro to a beautiful song, Elvis Costello's Allison. In my opinion, one of the most beautiful uh, songs in all of pop rock. Very cool, and very cool intro from the guitar. In fact, that whole song is very neat. If you want to learn, um, if you want to learn sort of R&B type of guitar, listen to that guy play. He never ever steps on the singer, not once. And he's playing a lot of cool fills, like um, you know, that kind of stuff. And he plays it in between the singer's breaks and breath. So it's uh, very neat. Now, but we're going to do the uh, opening, which is also, in and of itself, pretty interesting for two reasons. One is that the, basically the whole thing's played on the second string. It's in E, and it's played on the second string. second thing that's interesting is that, despite the fact that it's in E, it's always an implied chord, and we never actually land on that chord in the intro. So, in fact, we're playing over the, over the following chords. It starts on the V chord, which is a B, and it goes through the following sequence. And that's just an A flat minor, A, uh, a D flat minor, B. All those, all those chords are diatonic to E. And then finally, we'll do the uh, F sharp minor. That's A flat minor, and then A flat minor to B. And we're ready for the turn of the song. Oh, it's so funny, which is an A chord, and then finally the E chord. See you after so long, girl. You know, and, and that's how it goes. All right, so let's check out the, um, let's check out that intro. All right, so it starts out um, by hammering on, right in the very beginning, by hammering on from the ninth to the twelfth on the second string, like so. Okay, so it's a nice little hammer on. And now we're going to do a bunch of flutter moves. So the first flutter moves move is this one right here. So you'll shift up to the and, and you want to be moving around your fingers or your hand a lot over the fretboard, it gives it that fluid motion. Okay, the second part is, or the second piece is to play this. Okay, and that is simply playing the fourteenth, the twelfth. And then you're going to hammer on and pull off and slide down. So I call that a flutter move. And then hammer back on on the 12th. So you're going to play 14th, 12th, flutter, slide down to the 9th, and then hit the and then hit the 12th again. So it's like this. Okay? So so far we've got Okay, second little piece is another flutter. So we're going to flutter from the 9th to the 12th. That means play the 9th, hammer on the 12th, pull off, and then we're going to slide down to the 7th. I guess we play the 12th first and then the 9th, and then flutter. Okay, so um, once we do that, then we're going to play from the 7th. We're going to hit that and slide down to the 5th. So it's like this. Okay, so it's it's like hitting hitting the seventh, sliding down to the fifth, and then uh, hitting the fifth, sliding down to the fourth, and then playing the second and the open B. Okay, finally at the end we're gonna play on the third string. We're gonna play from the third and slide very quickly up to the fourth. It's almost like just a little quick note, a little grace note. So we'll play like this. <laughs> And then play on the second and third on the third fret and slide up to the fourth three times. Okay? So one more time, let's do the whole thing. I guess I forgot this. We're going to play the uh, fifth. That's five, four, two, oh. for the song. Okay? So that's basically it. Um, I forgot that little uh, that little walk down, which is the 5-4. And 
you can just play it with the same finger, kind of pulling down. If you really want to, you can also play it in this position entirely by playing and then on the third you play the sixth and then play the fourth. That's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this one. Uh, let me know what else you want to hear. Um, nice little simple and uh, easy and also very beautiful little intro. Take care. Bye.